Hello everybody, this is Jesse from Napco Tech Support, and today I'm going to go over the setup wizard on the IBR Touch and IBR Touch WL keypad tablets. On initial startup, it's going to ask you what type of device you want this to be, a keypad only, if you just wanted a virtual touchscreen keypad, or full functionality if you wanted all the abilities of the IBR Z remote, or Starlink Connect Radio. We're going to pick full functionality. Next, you would pick your camera type, the IC video cameras, the iBridge Video ISV2 series, or if you're not using any cameras, you would pick no cameras. Today, we're going to pick iBridge Video ISV2. Next, you're going to select your router from the drop-down window, and then enter in the password of that router. Once done, click Save and Next, and it's going to configure and connect to your wireless router. This process may take a few minutes, so p please be patient. And remember, if you're connecting this to a Starlink Connect radio, the Starlink Connect radio must be connected to the customer's network and the IP path enabled. Once successfully connected, click on the next button, and it's going to locally connect to your IBRZ remote or Starlink Connect radio. Once done, click next. Now it's going to ask you for your iBridge credentials, your remote login. If it's your IBRZ remote, you're going to put in your supplied username and password. Um, same with the Starlink Connect radio, radio ID number, and the password, and then click on finish. It's going to connect to the cloud and then boot up to the home pie screen with our full keypad automation switches and thermostats and finally the local camera connection and as always, for more information, you can visit us on the web at tech.napcosecurity.com. Thank you all for watching today.